guys, welcome to my channel. Today's video is a makeup haul and I have been waiting for a few products and so this video was way overdue. But finally all the products have arrived. I was gonna upload this video in August last month but one very important product was still pending so the video kind of got delayed. Most of these products are affordable. Only like one or two might be uh, on the high end side but I'm gonna just share all of it with y'all. So yeah, let's just jump straight into it. Okay, so I'm gonna start off with a primer which has been the talk of the town because of Nikki tutorials on YouTube and I'm sure you know this one. So it's the Nivea Aftershave Balm. I'm gonna mention all the details down in the description box. So it comes in a box like this and this is what the bottle looks like. Uh, it has a screw-on cap. It's supposed to be like this amazing primer and so clearly I wanted to try it out. So yeah, that's what that is for. The next thing I ordered was this uh, Bharat and Doris foundation. It's uh, a cream foundation. This is the number 01 and there were only three um, shades in that. Comes in this really tiny eyeshadow uh, kind of you know packaging and so I thought maybe for traveling I could just use it or I could use it as an eyeshadow base because hmm, we shall see. Also uh, someone had requested a review on this foundation so yeah I think you will be seeing that as well. I'm going to use this in one of my makeup videos and let you all know how it is. So for this next product, this, it's a contour cream series but it has 15 colours. I'm just going to open it up for you all. This has everything in this tiny little palette over here. So I'm going to show you all exactly what I'm talking about. So this is what it looks like. It has three colour correctors, four actually, the yellow one as well. It just depends on your skin tone. It has all the colours over here. So if you're on the lighter side, you can actually use these as a concealer, highlighter, even a foundation if you would. And if uh, and you can use these as your contouring, cream contouring shades. This product was so affordable. I'm really excited to try this and actually test the quality out. Moving on to the next product, I have a blusher by Lancome and it's in the shade A Plum or A Plum, however you like to pronounce it. And uh, this is what it looks like. It's again this tiny thing. Yeah, this is not on the affordable side. It comes with this tiny brush and which I, I'm not really going to use I think. This shade looks like a really natural pink uh, tone and it's matte. I haven't yet tested this one out as well, so even this is left, everything is left to test, I think, except for one thing. Well, I'm sure you are really familiar with the next product and that is my LA Girl Pro Concealers. So I bought one concealer and I bought one contour shade. The first concealer is in the shade Creamy Beige. Now after I researched and I did upload a video before this uh, using these, this shade of concealer has yellow tones and I have yellow tones in my skin so it went perfectly. I was considering another shade natural but uh, after doing a little bit of research I got to know that, that that has more of a pink undertone and so I picked up this one. I really really like the concealer. It is so blendable and it actually makes your skin so even. So I think if you're on the uh, lighter side of Indian skin tones Creamy beige is a really good shade for us. Both this does not work as a highlighter, it's just a concealer. So, so I had to use something else to highlight. As for my uh, cream contour, I bought this shade and this is in the shade Beautiful Bronze. I bought these two from Nykaa. This is a good shade if you want a natural contour uh, effect. Though if you are looking for a heavier contour effect, then you should go for the shade Espresso. And that is a bit darker, so that would be um, a better choice. But I went for this one and uh, what I like to do is I like to set this with a bronzing powder. That way I get the same effect and I also set my contour. So now I'm going to move on to the product that I was actually waiting for. That is these brushes, like we know, are very much again famous. So I got these off Amazon. You do get these from Pack and Makeup Revolution and all but they are obviously way more expensive. But I wanted to try something more affordable and I got this just for um, I think 1100 rupees. As for the quality, I don't see much of a difference because again it has this flexible head just like the Pack ones and also the bristles seem 
dense. So that's what we need and and yeah from what I can see these seem pretty awesome. Also if you follow me on Snapchat you'll know that this size of my pack brush broke. And yeah I actually had bought that one brush for 800 rupees and it just ended up breaking. So the next interesting product I bought were lashes. You do get these long, beautiful, fake lashes abroad, but I'm, talk I'm gonna talk about India here. So I think PAC is one of my favorite uh, brands for lashes. They have affordable lashes, but I really wanted to buy one of those, you know, extended, beautiful lashes. And so I decided to buy this pair of lashes and I'm gonna link it down below as well from where I bought it. These are so, so gorgeous. And as we're talking about lashes, I just ended up picking up uh, another pair of my favorite PAC lashes. This is in the number 58 and uh, yeah, these are the ones, these are pretty dense and I really love how they look on the eye. This and the number 213 in pack I think are um, two of my favourites so I have picked this one for now. Talking about eyes, I am going to move on to uh, the eyeshadow kit that I bought and this is by LA Girl Neons. One side has a sponge and the other one has the brush. And they have 12 shades over here. Also, if you want a detailed review on all these makeup products, you can log on to my blog. I keep uploading reviews every now and then on all the products that I try. Moving on to the lips, I bought this lip pencil by PAC. And this is in the shade Auburn. So, uh, it's sort of like a maroonish red. This is the one I'm wearing right now and I've used it as a lipstick just so that you can see the colour. But again, these are really affordable. As for nail polishes, I just got one. And yeah, I got this really long back. It's this one by Nykaa and it is a very, very beautiful blue shade. So, it's in the number 73 and the, the name is not written but I'm pretty sure these have a name and I'm going to find it out and write it somewhere over here. I like two shades and one is this one and one is the mint one. I know this is not a makeup product but I still wanted to share it with y'all because it is so adorable. So I got this phone cover like last week and sadly my phone fell into the lift crack and now it's spoiled. So I don't have a phone for this cover. So yeah, we'll see about that. This is the cover and it's got a panda on it. I am obsessed with pandas. I just love them. They are so cute. And yeah, so I was just really excited to get this. And so I wanted to share it with you all. So we come to the end of this video. And I will see you all in my next one.